you did yeah. this for quite some time. And then by the time I meet you, you're this unbelievable pastelist. Were you doing pastels? And did you continue doing watercolor this whole time? Or how did you get involved with the pastels? Well, my sister actually introduced me to pastels. I was 14 years old when we moved from Oregon down to Southern California. My sister liked to dabble in it a little bit. She had a little bit of uh, artistic interest and talent. So she introduced me to, to pastels. And I started doing them at home. I got a little bit larger set, but not very big. But um, I could do some things with that. And I really liked it. I liked the forgiving quality of it and the ease in application, the fact you could set it down and go away and do something else and come back and you didn't have dried paint to worry about or anything. And when I was in high school, <clears throat> I started doing uh, portraits of, of fellow classmates for five bucks, <laughs> you know, and I got a good enough likeness. They were satisfied, I guess. And uh, I did that off and on um, during high school. And I had an English literature teacher that kind of mentored me. It was surprising you would think of be an art teacher, but this English teacher took a liking to me, I guess, and she became a kind of a mentor. And so she got me into uh, working with the journalism class. We, we produced our own newspaper in this high school at a printing shop and everything. So I was cutting uh, linoleum block prints for the various things for the sports teams and all that stuff. And eventually this English teacher had me paint a portrait for her. And then she suggested I do one of the principal of the school, which I did and donated to the school. I've often wondered whatever happened to that, but I got a good likeness from a photo. He was a well-loved and respected principal. So that's kind of how I got uh, involved with pastel. And I would do it off and on. I, I painted in oil and I painted in watercolor acrylics when they came along. But I always went back to pastel every, every once in a while. So tell me, how has your faith impacted your work? For one thing, I was raised in a Christian home and I've been going to church all my life. When I was 14 years old, the pastor asked me to do a poster for the ch little church we were going to in Burbank, which incidentally is the same one I met my wife in. But anyway, they had a, a men's fellowship meeting scheduled. And he asked me to do a poster for that, which I did. And that became a bit of a hit for my age and so forth. So from then on, every church that I've been in, they soon discovered that I had some skills and put me to work, you know, doing Christmas uh, play background scenery and, you know, Easter pageant things and illustrated sermons. Uh, I mean, there was just all kinds of projects that I've done over the years, many, many from just small little projects to huge, spectacular, large things, um, you know, that became a blessing, I guess, and a testimony to other people. That's, that's beautiful. 